Good morning reception. I hope you've all had a lovely weekend. Our topic is animal crackers and this week we're going to learn about zoo animals. These animals usually live in the jungle but in this country we see them at the zoo. Ooh, the book I'm going to read today is called Rumble in the Jungle by Giles Andre. Let's see what animals we can find. There's a rumble in the jungle. There's a whisper in the trees. The animals are waking up and rustling the leaves. The hippo's at the waterhole, the leopard's in his lair. And the chimpanzees are chattering and swinging everywhere. Some animals are frightening and some are sweet and kind. Let's go to the jungle now and see what we can find. Look at them all hiding. I wonder what we'll see. A chimpanzee. It's great to be a chimpanzee swinging through the trees and if we can't find nuts to eat, we munch each other's fleas. Ugh. Do you know this animal? I found one of these at my house. It's a lion. The lion is the king of the jungle. Just listen how loudly he roars. Every animal quivers and shudders and shivers as soon as he opens his jaws. Scary lion. Stomp, stomp. It's an elephant. It's great to be an elephant, all big and fat and round, and wander through the jungle just elephanting around. Ooh, a stripy one. And I found one of these too. Do you know what it is? A zebra. I could have been grey like a donkey or brown like my cousin the mule but instead I've got stripes which my lady friend likes and they make me look handsome and cool. Stripey zebra. <gasps> snake, that's right. The boa constrictor is a slippery snake who slivers and slides round his tree. And when tasty animals wander too close, he squashes them slowly for tea. <laughs> oh, I'm sure you all know this tall animal. It's a giraffe. Some, some animals laugh at the gangly giraffe, but I hold my head up and I feel proud. I don't really care when my head's in the air and my cheek's getting kissed by a cloud. Oh, pretty giraffe. Oh, I found one of these too. You know what it is? It's a hippopotamus. Hello, I'm a big happy hippo. I sleep in the sun to get hot. And when I'm not sleeping, I mooch in the mud, with hi which hippos like doing a lot. Look, he's in the mud. <gasps> Who's this snappy green creature? It's a crocodile. When animals come to the river to drink, I watch for a minute or two. It's such a delight to behold such a sight that I can't resist chomping a few. It's not kind, Mr. Crocodile. Ooh. What animal's this one? He's got a long horn on the end of his nose. It's a rhinoceros. The ravenous rhino is big, strong and tough, but his skin is all baggy and flappy, which means that there's plenty of room for his lunch and that makes him terribly happy. This is called a gazelle. No one can run half as quickly as me. The galloping, gorgeous gazelle. I leap up so high that my horns touch the sky and I'm pretty as well. Thud, thud. It's a big gorilla, bashing his chest. The gorilla is big, black and hairy, and the thing that he likes to do best is to look all ferocious and scary and wallop his giant great chest. He's a baby gorilla. A leopard. If you meet a hungry leopard prowling through the night, make sure you call him sir and be incredibly polite. Who's this one here? He's stripy too, but he's not a zebra. It's a tiger. Beware of the terrible tiger. You don't always know when he's near. 
but his eyes like to sh shine like light through the blackest of nights, and his brow makes you tremble with fear. <laughs> Scary. Now it's night time in the jungle. The night has starting falling, but the jungle never sleeps. The vultures circle slowly while the leopard softly creeps. And if you listen quietly, you might just hear the growl of a hungry pair of panthers who are still out on the prowl. The lions and their little cubs are sleeping in their den, so let's leave them till tomorrow when we'll visit them again. Wow, ooh, look at that page, it's like a zebra. Story has finished. Thank you for listening.